India Automation Challenge 2023 A Novel Initiative to Encourage Engineering Students India Automation Challenge 2023 welcomes budding engineers of India to design and build automation systems with practical applications. Industrial Automation is published by Mumbai-based IED Communications Ltd. And the company is also organizer of the iconic Automation Expo series of annual exhibition and conference programs. Vivekanand Education Society's Institute of Technology, Mumbai. We are at Vivekanand Education Society's Institute of Technology, Mumbai, and we have with us uh, Prajwal Pujari, uh, Naimatullah Mullah. Umesh Suasia. Great. So, uh, can you guys explain uh, what is your basic product concept about? So, this is basically a prototype for hand gesture platform dimension. Uh, so, I basically built this to reduce the problems like the which we have in the manual wheelchair uh, because they need strength to put the manual wheelchair and personal assistant. As well as the joystick wheelchair in the current Indian market are really expensive. So, we are uh, trying to build a product which will be cost effective as well as. Uh, useful for the uh, old age people as well as the handicapped people so basically this is the hand gesture uh, the controller the user needs to wear in his hand to control it if the person does not have its uh, particular hand part of his hand so it can be po uh, put in any of the upper body also and it can control using the hand gesture so Nemeth can give you the uh, the concept and the interface of this thing so so basically, uh, we are do, uh, transmitting uh, and receiving the gestures by wireless communication. Uh, in the trans in this band, uh, we are detecting the gestures, and uh, via this uh, uh, wireless communication, we are transmitting to re receiver side wheelchair, uh, due to which the wheelchair moves. Great. So, what is your entire material? What is you know the material made up of? Uh, like right now, since it's a uh, prototype level, we are made by via wood and uh, motors, like basic uh, components. Oh, okay. Um, why do you think this is going to be a unique product? Uh, like uh, uh, in India, there are manual wheelchair and the electric ones. But the electric wheelchairs comes from the uh, abroad. Uh, they are not manufactured in India. So uh, right now in India, there is no such a thing. Uh, and for the handicapped people also, uh, they uh, they may have problem to use the joystick one because they don't have the parts of the hand or something like that. So they can uh, they can also use our uh, product. Like when it becomes the product, they can use also by wearing the hands on different parts of it. How uh, difficult is it for a user to use the... Uh, like uh, since it's a uh, prototype level, it may have some problems. But when we will uh, made it to product level, it won't have... Uh, uh, problems like uh, there are we have got some way, many suggestions like if my hand moves like this uh, what will happen the wheelchair move or not so we have the given the safety feature like uh, that is a switch if you turn off the switch the wheelchair will not move at all uh, only when I want to uh, move uh, I can switch on the switch and control it where do you think this product will really work well I mean will it be an end user or will it be healthcare uh, you know systems that would want your product work for both also uh, for end user also and for uh, healthcare system like uh, in hospitals so yes great who do you think would be your key vendors or you know acquirers of this product uh, like a wheelchair uh, those who we manufacture the wheelchair we can uh, tell tell them our concept how it works so they can uh, do our work, uh, they can install our uh, concept in their wheelchair and they can sell it for you. So you, you can use the technology on uh, regular wheelchairs as well? Yeah, uh, we are trying to make a kit uh, like thing so you can just install the, that kit and uh, you can uh, change your manual wheelchair to this uh, gesture control wheelchair. How uh, cost effective is this going to be? Uh, like uh, we have uh, estimated the product cost, it comes between 30 to 35,000. So we wish you guys all the best, especially for your project and your product, the project and also your competition.
thank you for the demo. Um, while I saw the functionality of this, you've been controlling it purely on your wrist. Does it have a speed control? Uh, right now it does not have speed control, but we are studying on it. Uh, studying on it, and uh, the end uh, product uh, which will be made, uh, it will have the speed control. And how really would that speed control work? Uh, basically, it would need to work like we have con uh, in the future, uh, the actual wheelchair will high torque motors. So using the PWM concept, we can control the speed also. So because most of the uh, hospitals, uh, the wheelchair move on slopes and all and steep slopes. So we need to, uh, we need to have the disc brake also for emergency braking system and as well as the speed control thing using the gestures only. Like currently we have only st uh, stay one speed at this th thing but if we uh, move towards uh, uh, at a different angle also the speed should move accordingly to, so we will implement it as that way. Any risk of toppling over? Uh, like that's why we have given some uh, emergency switch like uh, there is a switch uh, in the wheelchair if you turn off the switch nothing will happen. And there will be a disc brake also for the emergency braking system and all. You, and the tires are better quality so that I have uh, better uh, grip on the floor like that. Great, so lovely product, lovely concept. Wish you all the best once again. Thank you.